So there's this girl that's been emailing me on YouTube. We'll call her Katie. She's in ninth grade, she's a virgin, and a bunch of guys at her school are calling her a cunt. She wrote me and asked, Lacey, what do I do? It's obvious she's hurt. Cunt is a dirty, profane word in our society that is used to degrade women. Katie, I have something to tell you. I have news for you. The origin of the word cunt is that it came from the oriental goddess Kunti, or Kanda. She was the great yoni of the universe. That's right, cunt used to represent beauty, power, and the amazing ability of the female body to produce and grow a baby, a new life. People made shrines to the cunt. They were everywhere. The cave walls, the wells, the groves. Everyone was worshipping the cunt. But someone didn't like that. That someone was the medieval clergyman. They came in and declared all the shrines of the female genitalia to be obscene. Disgusting. Something to be ashamed of. They renamed these shrines as the Kunis Diaboli, or the devilish cunt. And if you were caught worshipping them, they could burn you at the stake. It seems that the word cunt is back in society, and it's being used in the same derogatory way that the medieval clergyman had intended it to be used. This time it's being used by men and women. Katie, I wanted to tell you this so that next time one of those guys calls you a cunt, you can maybe think about and remember and keep close to you that the reason that they even know that word is something derogatory is because a bunch of men were scared of your vagina. So, I personally am reclaiming the word cunt, but I love mine. I mean, about like